So I just got really tired the last couple of days, like living in fear and thinking he was gonna come over unannounced again. <laughs> Happy June! Today's June 1st. We're gonna celebrate. In Bentley Bears, he's being happy today. Say, I'm so happy. I feel like a puppy with no roof. Bless you, Bubble. Lay down. Down. Lay down. Good boy. Roll! I still have to make him roll, but I'm hoping he'll get it sooner or later. So I went shopping today and I spoiled him. Surprise, surprise. We got this. Because the Toys R Us toys were on sale. I forgot what I went to Petco for in the first place. Let's see if he likes it. It doesn't squeak. I thought it squeaked. Let's see. Bentley, do you like this? Go get it. Go get it. Do you like it? Mommy bought it for you. Tell me that you like it. Say, I like it so much. I'm so grateful that you buy me ridiculous stuff. Um, there's a lot going on. There's rope and a ball and a turtle. Can you not record me? I'm trying to, I'm trying to figure it out. Um, I don't, I don't, I don't know. It might be too much for me. Oh, I, I like it. I, I, oh, I don't know. It's, I'm gonna, it's really big, Mom. It's really big. Um, I'm gonna, ooh, I'm gonna, why don't, why don't you take it from me and throw it? Go get it. I, I love it. Oh my God, I love it. I love it. I love it. Bring it. Bring it. Go get the laundry. You heard a beep? Go get it. Go get the laundry. I wish he would go get the laundry. I don't know if you heard it, but the dryer just beeped. Go get it, Bentley. You want to see what else Mama got you? She got you a whole bag of stuff because you're spoiled. We got a ball and a rope from Toys R Us for pets. Let's see if he likes it. Do you like this one? Um... I, it's smaller, so that's awesome. It has that rope ball thing going on. Yeah, I like it. I like it a lot. Thanks, Mom. I, I really like it. Oh my God. You are awesome, Mom. You, are, you get the best toys. Like, give it to me. Throw it. Throw it, Mom. Yes. Bring me, bring it, bring it. I think he likes that one better. Looks like freaking kinder, puppy kindergarten in here. So many toys. What else did you get? We got you a new Nylabone, and hopefully it won't turn you orange. I have a feeling this is going to be a fail, because I don't think he's going to be interested. Do you like it? It's lamb and apple. You can chew it forever. Chew it. Fail. Oh, maybe it's not a fail. Yes. And it was on sale. I got him this. It's like Martha Stewart pets. And you put food in it, like their kibble. So let's see if he likes it. Go get it. Do you like it? There's food in it. And it's hard to get it out, so you should stay busy forever. Where's your other ball that had food in it? It's probably under the couch. And now I'm being OCD, and I am organizing my K-cups for the week. I mean, I don't do this every week, but I bought more new ones, and it's just throwing off my whole swag. I got these new ones. I don't know if I like it yet. Donut Shop Coconut Mocha. I love coconut. Well, like, I love the way coconut smells and candles. I don't know if I'm gonna like coconut mocha coffee, but we'll see. Oh, and I got the lemonade. 
that I've been wanting to try and it's good. And I just need to get rid of these because I hate them. They're not bad, they just... Since, you, since I make iced coffee, I need a medium or dark roast blend. And that is a light roast, so then it always tastes like water. Mmm, lemonade. It's just so weird because it's natural lemonade and it's not yellow. So then what is it? I don't know. And I have these stupid sweet teas that I hate. Louisiana. I guess I'm not southern enough. These are gonna go in the loser pile. Me and the Bentleys are gonna call it a night. I was gonna talk to you guys about my awkward stalker situation. Okay, I'll just do it real quick. I'm so tired. And Bentley's acting crazy. He has the zoomies right now. And I don't even understand what he's doing. There's stuff everywhere. So I just got really tired the last couple of days, like living in fear and thinking he was gonna come over unannounced again, and I was just over it. And I just went from zero to hood rat in two seconds. He was calling and texting me all night, so finally I got pissed out. So all this happened at 1.30 in the morning. He said, hey, I said, what could you possibly want at 1 a.m.? And he was like, to be honest, I was wondering if you'd like to chill. And I said, at 1.30 a.m. and do what? Here's where it gets sexual. So you, oh, once again, you might go off on me, talk, give you a nice massage and have some fun. So, oh, this is me? Oh, so you're looking for a late night booty call. Him, I'd like to be more than a friend to you right now. How about you? Not looking for a Sorry. Then he said, it's a friends with benefits relationship. That's different. I'm sure you'd like someone to help you with your carnal desires. I said, I don't. He said, hmm, okay. If you ever change your mind, he spelled something weird. I, I don't know what that word means and it's probably not going to show up. So I said, hashtag, I'm good. You seemed like a nice guy. I know, I now regret giving you my number. You seem horny. Go text some other slore who's about that life. Goodbye. Emoji. He said, a nice person has fun from time to time. I'm sorry for coming off rude to you. May we start over? It's like the third time he had to start over and there's nothing to start because we're never friends. So I went in. I said, yes. Let's start over from the beginning. Pretend you never met me and lose my number. I do not want to hear from you. I do not want you coming near where I live again. I will never want a stranger over at my place at odd hours of the night. Do not call. Do not text me again. Don't wait two days and ask if we could start over. You made it clear what you're looking for and I do not want... I suggest you go on Craigslist. You'll find what you're looking for there. If you attempt to contact me again, you'll either receive a reply from one of my crazy ass cousins or the SSPD, Sandy Springs Police. And he hasn't said a word then. And if he does text or call me or come over one more time, I will call the police and I will call my ratchet cousin. But I'm gonna say goodnight because I'm sleepy. I'd let you, I'd let ben, the Bentleys come out and say goodnight, but um, yeah, he's, he's really busy right now. He's under the couch doing some real important, weird, oh, you found my friction pen. Oh, heck no. Heck no. He's crazy. He's crazy. Hi, Bobby. Come out. You're not even there. I don't know where he is. So, bye! I need to get that friction pen back. He's gonna turn all purple. Oh, I love him, but he makes me crazy.